Hi, welcome to this video dedicated to the installation of Betaflight for your Rao Parco 280. As you may know, this one is coming with the uh, op uh, CC security board compatible with Open Pilot, of course. So I removed the lateral plate here in order to show you the uh, uh, internal parts. Okay, so uh, be sure before to do this uh, mode, this installation, to remove props and to install. Uh, the antenna, okay, to not cook your video transmitter because you will have to plug your quad capture. So you will need a basic uh, USB cable, mini uh, connector on one side. So uh, the first thing to do will be first to download the last uh, beta flight version. Okay, so you go to the uh, depository, depot, at this URL, okay, and download this file ending with opbl.bin, okay? You save it, already done it. You save it in your local folder, okay? And now you will need to plug your um, uh, micro mini USB cable, okay? Do not plug the uh, other side, and you will need to run the uh, open pilot uh, software. Okay, uh, one is done, you go to the firmware here, and you have to press the rescue uh, button, okay? So now you have time of 20 seconds to plug your USB, okay? When it's done, you can see this message, and uh, since I read a flash, uh, you don't, don't have any more the information about the Open Pilot firmware. But in any case, you have to click on Open, and you have to uh, look for your saved file, the Open uh, Beta Flight. So actually, it's the version um, Two, sorry, two uh, dot three dot three. If I'm not wrong, okay, quadcopter, okay, this one. So this is a better fly underscore this is really the underscore opbl. I select the file, okay. I click on I know what I'm doing, and I click on flash. It will take a couple of seconds to uh, do this job, okay. So. Uh, actually, uh, it will, it's flashing, as you can see here, okay. And after, you, have, you will have to disconnect uh, the USB, or you can, you can quit uh, Open Pilot software, disconnect. Okay, now you will go to um, uh, the application, okay, and run the uh, Clean Flight software. So if you connect it, unfortunately, nothing happened, okay, that's normal. Uh, don't be afraid. Uh, you will need at least to power your quadcopter. Okay, so be sure to have one more time to have your antenna plug to not cook your uh, video transmitter. So I will plug it, but if you connect it, no miracle also. So there is, uh, even you say there is an unknown device. You have to wait at least three or four beeps. Three, three, okay, four, maybe. And after you have this other type of music, now you can plug your USB. And the COM port now appear. Okay, so you click on connect. Okay, and now, okay, everything is here. Your quadcopter is moving. Ooh, great news. So first of all, you have to go to configuration. Okay. And at least do two, two things. Disable one shot, 105 uh, Features, unfortunately, your AC are not compatible, and click on RX PPM because your, uh, in fact, your uh, uh, receiver is connected in PPM mode. You have to save and reboot, okay? Okay, and when you reboot, unfortunately, you are losing again your USB connection. So, one more time, you disconnect your USB cable, disconnect your, uh, your uh, power. Reconnect your power, okay, you have to wait now uh, three or four times this USC music, beep. Okay, you have to be patient, one, two, three, okay, you came at three, but now you can plug, sometimes it's faster to boot. Okay, now you can click on connect. And now, if I go to the receiver, Okay, and I'm turn on the radio. Oh, good news, it's working. Okay, you can see that AUX1 is working, AUX2 too. So why not to configure um, uh, some flight mode on AUX1? So I will go to uh, um, mode, 
Okay, and I will add, for example, one switch A in upper position, the horizon mode. Okay, and I will go down, uh, go as to see the limit, and I will set the level something here. Okay, now I will add um, uh, another range, this one, this mode, air mode, and go to uh, the upper part of the limit, like this. Okay, now I'm saving. As you can see, I can swap between the two or uh, horizon air mode. Okay, so now it's time to save. And voila, is configured. So um, I will try to harm. It's working. I can disarm. Okay, Betafly is installed. Okay, when the uh, Betafly is now it's installed, uh, it's not finished completely. Uh, the problem that the uh, between there is a difference between the Open Pilot and uh, um, Beta flights, it's about, about the motor layout. So, for example, Open Pilot motor, this one is one, two, uh, three, four, if I'm not wrong, and for Beta flight, this one is a four, this one is a two, or something like this. So, you have a different motor layout. It means that if you directly try to fly, it will flip because uh, for him, uh, is, there is a problem with the uh, of motor identification or association. So, what you have to do is to um, apply uh, on the uh, SLE uh, the um, uh, mixture model, a kind of uh, apply a kind of rotation matrix, and to be able to to be okay. So one more time, I will uh, connect. Okay, uh, connect my 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 uh, my system. I will wait probably the music. We come, okay. Okay. So I have to de deploy, sorry. I will restart, wait the few beeps. Not the hand. One beep. Okay, and I will show which mixture element you have to apply. Okay, now I'm plugged and I select this file and I will apply this stuff. So I will open with, with my not plus plus plus. Okay, and I will select this uh, settings here. Okay, copy. And now I can connect. And you will have to go on the command here. And now when I select it, you can pass your information. Okay, and with this setting now, the uh, layout is okay for our uh, beta flights. So you can, of course, don't forget to, to save. You is saving and you will have again to uh, uh, discard it. Reconnect, wait the music, okay. And voila, wait, beep, okay, now you can connect. And uh, to be sure that it's working, uh, it's uh, for the layout, you have uh, one tip, uh, you can first reconnect, okay, and you will see that uh, if I, uh, okay, if I arm in the quadcopter, okay, and you will see that if I if I'm moving the quadcopter in this sense, okay, you will see this motor is spinning faster. In the, if I go front, the both two motors are spinning faster. If I go rear, the two. So it's a way to check that your uh, mix is working, okay. I will do that now. Thank you for watching.